We have 367 students at this time and we are growing. Why don't you get somebody to help you? CPA really is a family oriented school. Most of our families, our students, their brother, sister, our cousin has attended the school. Go ahead, Kaylee, why? Not only that, our faculty and staff is a family and a team and um, they make sure that students are getting the best education and they meet them at their level and try to take them beyond. Charleston Progressive, it just offers so much between diversity, between the Leader and Me program, offering students the opportunity to, to be not just students, but to be leaders in the school, in the community, in their homes, in their churches. It just really gives the students that opportunity to be academic leaders and not just when it comes to math and, and science, but with leadership qualities. I think CPA is one of the top tier schools. We're doing so many things like we have iPads one-on-one -on -one for every single student in the building. We're doing Leader in Me, which is building leadership skills from CD, four years old, all the way up. CPA helps students prepare to be a leader, it helps them be prepared for their own, take responsibility for their own actions. Um, working together, collaborating. But at CPA, the faculty and staff, um, we have bought into that shared vision. The personal mastery has shared vision. And I think that our faculty really has that shared vision together with Ms. Sheets. And now the children have that shared vision. Each classroom has come up with their shared vision. They can recite that shared vision. And they know that it's preparing them for the next levels, the next things to come. And it's not a just about today. It's about the future. Habit number one, be proactive. Being proactive is when you are in charge of yourself. Habit number two, begin with the end in mind. Begin with the end in mind means to have a plan and do it. Habit number three, put first things first. Put first things first means setting priorities. Habit number four is think win-win. I win, you win. We win. Habit number five is seek first to understand, then to be understood. It means I look people in the eyes while talking. It also means I listen to other people's feelings. Habit number six, synergize. I synergize by working well in groups. Habit number seven, sharpen the saw. I sharpen the saw by going on walks. It just gives me joy when I wake up in the morning. My goal is how can we make a difference in the lives of our students? We know in order to be a productive citizen that you have to be a leader. CPA is building tomorrow's leaders and we look forward to seeing where our leaders are going to go and how far they can go.